Hey guys, it's Ryan back here again. In Tenerving Halo 3 Legendary Collection, Master Chief. This statue was released in 2008 and retailed for $19.99. According to McFarlane, this is an action figure. But in my opinion, something that's static is a statue. For the most part, it's just Master Chief in a fighting pose, along with three flood infection forms in mid-attack. It does come off a display base and two display rods to give the infection forms a boost. Master Chief himself is based off his Halo 3 appearance, wearing green Mark 6 armor, and he's also wielding a shotgun. Just like any other McFarlane Master Chief out there, he's heavily detailed and as accurate as possible. The seams for the armor are outlined in black, there's also blue lights here and there, and underneath the armor is a black jumpsuit. The visor on the helmet is painted in gold, and sculpted on the sides is headlights, which have silver and black paint detailing. Sculpted onto the chest plate is battle damage. And he's not completely static, as his arms are on swivel joints, allowing them to go up and down individually. And with a little bit of work, the shotgun can be removed. All three infection forms are mounted on black display rods, which are mounted on the display stand, but that doesn't mean that they're permanently attached. They're fairly detailed, with three feelers each that have red painted tips and multiple tentacles. And if you don't like the base, everything can actually be removed from it, including the display rods. And Chief himself can stand up just fine without it. So for about $20, even though it wasn't made out of high quality material, it was still a pretty good statue, just lacking in size and coolness factor. But if you're looking for another Master Chief to add to your collection, as if you haven't had enough already, you might want to consider this piece. So anyways, that pretty much does it for this review. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you all in the next video. Subscribe for hundreds of collectible reviews, including Halo and Star Wars, and follow me on Facebook and Twitter for up-to-date channel news.